Good morning, Fast Motorsports, or whatever time you're watching this. Now, if you caught our event coverage of the Ultimate Callout Challenge, thanks for watching, but also this was filmed the same weekend. So last night, I flew from Indianapolis to Florida. Now I'm in Cocoa Beach for the P1 Powerboat Race. If you didn't know, Fast Diesel Fuel Systems, as of now, officially sponsors a team based out of Lake of the Ozarks. We're gonna go try to find them and get some really sweet racing footage. We have a helicopter booked for later, so hopefully we have some cool uh, up top aerial views of the race too. But uh, yeah, really excited. Fast motorsports, fast diesel fuel systems, P1 powerboat racing, baby. Let's do it. Alright guys, so that was riding in a helicopter. Now the boat you saw unfortunately was not the fast boat. Now we did get some footage and you just saw it of the actual fast boat. Unfortunately, it was not running. That said, if you are going to watch power boat racing, a helicopter is the best way to do it in my opinion. Now sure, you can sit on the beach and relax, but it's a lot more peaceful up in the air, let me tell you, as long as you're not afraid of heights. So we're back at the pits. We're gonna go check out some of the boats that are parked. Then we'll head to the pier where apparently you can see everything going on. And by then, hopefully the fast boat will be running. Now, for those of you that have not followed power boat racing before, you're just like me. This is my first event ever. Never seen it, never heard of it, never been part of it. And it's pretty cool. I walked into the pits and I told Brad, the founder and president of fast, I kind of get it. This is cool. This is really, really cool. And of course there's a lot of diesel trucks out here, which, uh, you know we're a fan of. So let's go check out these pits, then we'll head to the pier, try to get some racing. Alright guys, Monday morning we are back at the FAST offices. Now, 
We learned a lot of lessons about filming powerboat racing. Turns out it's not that easy. Logistically, it requires a lot of planning. So we're gonna apply some lessons learned to the next one, but this video ended up being a little bit of a hodgepodge of assorted clips. That said, if you ever get the chance to watch offshore powerboat racing, we would highly recommend the helicopter. It's really the best way to do it. Um, we hope you enjoyed this content. Big shout out to the Performance Powerboat Center team. We ended up finishing third, which was super cool for our first event. Again, we hope you enjoyed the video. And if you like stuff like this, be sure to hit subscribe. We'll see you next time.